In this second case, of forensic investigation, we suspect that uh, information about replay industry was leaked from our companies because we see it in our competitor. So we go here into the forensic tab and we're going to just search on replay industries, just like that. We click on the magnifying glass and what, what is it that we get? We get data not in, order, in chronological order but in order of relevance. So let's look at the first one uh, in here. What is it that we see here? Well, we see a chat of Deborah, Pete, and Adrian Smith, and you know what is this is all about? I really don't. I don't see replay industries anywhere in here. Why is the system telling me about it? And it's highlighting this as something important. Let me actually click on that document, and here it is. That's where replay industry was. Was inside the the, the payload, and that's what what he could actually find it. We go to the attribute as we did before. We can see the relationships between these two guys. Well, look at that. We we get web host, email as before, chat ID with Deborah, Adrian, hmm, uh, voice over IP. Well, look at that. Uh, let's, for example, click on here. We can we can even look at the actual conversation that this individual has. So I can. Scroll down here, and here I have. If I were to uh, if, uh, even click in here, I can even listen to the conversation. If I have the legal permission to do that, both parties have agreed to have the conversations recorded and all that. But I'm going to show you another feature in here, which is the surveyor. I can actually select the f the, this uh, element and, and tell the surveyor show me everything that happened 15 minutes before and 15 minutes uh, after that. So here's the event you know at the uh, that, that we are talking about so let's scroll down in here see you know some SSL some certificates some web pages you know more pages you know you can actually look and see everything he clicks everything he download everything he actually uh, did you see more pages more conversations uh, so we can actually you know reproduce everything that the people were doing so let's look at this for example this uh, 108 is actually that conversation that we just saw before and right after uh, that there's this one in here uh, some web pages and actually we're not going into the internet these are the actual pages and we render it exactly as he saw them uh, so if the pages changes after the investigation it doesn't matter we we, we are we, we have proof of what we actually uh, click on it so we click here in we see that this is uh, in yellow is because the, the guy actually click on it and when we click on it we get this page that seems to be an error but it's actually a redirection and he click here so let's click in there this is the actual page that the individual actually saw so it's very very powerful uh, uh, technology you can actually uh, see you know all those uh, let me actually go back here and put replay industries Back in the search, and uh, we we actually can select all the elements in here and see them and visualize them as we uh, did before. So if we click like this, well, we'll see a whole bunch of IP addresses. That doesn't tell me more. I prefer to see email addresses. Who has been emailing to who? Out of that group of data that we are looking at regarding replay industries and we see that there's been some marketing stuff in here well going from here to there and this is the side conversation that we actually saw before if we would have visualized this we probably would have gotten an, uh, a hint about that uh, leakage about our replay industries